All right, Michelle and James and Jensen are on a walk. I'm upstairs because I just put together, the room is, and the sound machine's going because it's about to be uh, bedtime. But put a little bookshelf right next to the chair so we can read stories for when we're tucking James in. And a few days earlier, I put these together out here before we just had like random trash in this little nook. I was like, well, let's get some cubes and we can put some books in here instead of in just huddled away in my closet. Actually looks pretty nice. Haven't uh, completely organized it. Well, kind of, I got all the Wheel of Time, uh, Dark Tower series, uh, Michelle's books, got some others, the Warcraft series. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So it leaves me open in my bookshelf in my office and I can actually put my doodads and knickknacks, like Pokemon figures and stuff in there, I know. Seems pretty cool, right? I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> but yeah, she took both of them for a walk so I could put that together and I put it together before they got back. So that's pretty neat. Other than that, um, we're kind of worried about Jensen's poop. I know, good information, but that's the number one sign of his surgery, if it went well or not. So we're just very much keeping track of everything that we can. Taking pictures. Yeah, I know it's kind of weird thinking that we got tons of pictures of poop on our phone, but it's just, it's just our life now. We're just always gonna be, I hope we're just overly sensitive about it and we're just kind of like overly aware and it's and it's no problem because if it is a problem then the little guy's gonna need they're probably back the little guy's gonna need a liver transplant and they're back just like I thought let me see him hi Jensen hi James hi Jensen James. <laughs> Finish their stro or uh, his uh, bookshelf. Put it upstairs. Yeah, put it upstairs and everything. Yeah. So, all right, that's our update right now. I'm gonna hang out with the kids until James goes down. I'm gonna clean up. I can't have my tools there. So, all right. Just got back from Barnes and Noble. Uh, this guy, this guy behaved pretty well. He, he made friends with an older lady at the cafe. Yeah, Michelle, Michelle and James are talking to her. Where, where'd he go? Yeah, she was talking to Michelle about having boys and how cool it is to have boys. Oh, she was saying she, she did want a daughter, but then she had two boys, and now when she talks to like her girlfriends who have daughters, she says she's glad she had boys. Yeah, so, but I'll show my book haul. Well, here's, oh, my foot. Yeah, move. I know, I was just trying to show Jensen. Oh no, Jensen. I got a Pokemon sticker book for James. I'm gonna take like three stickers for my new water bottle. Got book one of Malazan. I got the Poppy War, which I hear very, very good things about. I hear it's a very, very serious messed up book. Look at Mommy and Jensen. Um, it's been cranky since last night. Yes. Um, I'm kind of worried that he's not feeling well or something. He's got so much hair. He looks like a fuzzball. Because um, I was reading on the Facebook group 
the first symptoms of cholangitis, the infection of his of his surgery and his biliary. Mm -hmm, ducts and whatever. Yeah, yeah, that area, his liver, is um, paler poops and then fever and irritability. Hmm, well he's irritable right now, that's for sure. He uh, did not sleep as good as he usually does. He actually had three feedings last night instead of the regular two. The longest stretch was four hours. I know like that's still a good stretch, but we're used to his first stretch being five, six hours. Yeah, and he was just cranky. Yeah. He, he was he was not settled. I mean, we were also he was also sleeping in the pack and play versus the best net. We're trying to switch it out. And he went arms out on his uh, his sleep sack. So who knows? Back to the book haul real quick. So the poppy war. This was buy one get one fifty percent off. This is a series I saw that people rate highly. Red Rising. Um, the, 50, the other fifty percent off book I got was The Silence of the Lambs. So that's kind of neato. It's actually a really cool print of it too. So, um, book three of the Mistborn trilogy. There's. There's Vin right up there. I got book one of, what the heck is the series called? I think the Lycanus, Lycanius trilogy. Shadow of What Was Lost. Um, I hear very, very good things about this. And the print is very good. It feels very good. It's very thick. Um, the book I'm reading directly after the Mistborn trilogy. The Way of Kings. The reason why I'm reading the Mistborn trilogy. And then, I think one more. The other reason why we went is the blade itself. I can't remember the name of the, the series. Um, but I hear very good things about that too. So, pretty good haul. Come to uh, the Walmart we usually don't go to. It's the Walmart down the way from us. They really don't come here too often. What are we what are we coming here for again? I mean, yeah, I guess. I thought I thought we had to get something. Oh, um, wands. Oh, yeah. Toilet wands. <laughs> so, me and Mr. Man went on a bike ride. Holy Hannah, the uh when you get them when you get that gear into 7th it is a leg workout. So I was biking with him. I think it's also because he's just extra weight. He's an extra 30, 40 pounds, probably 40 pounds altogether with the uh, um, with the uh, trailer. But it's a good workout. Um, I'm going to give him some milk right now. Uh, as for those bookcases... Yeah, Michelle started uh, reading a story to James uh, as we were putting him to bed last night, and he seemed to like it, so, and I like my bookcases that I got. I wish I would have, we found at that Walmart we went to, we found they have a nine cube organizer, and we bought two six cube organizers, so if we could have bought two nine cube, it would have been taller, and it would have looked a lot better too, but... And then we would have more space, but what we got is pretty nice, so. Yeah, I'm gonna get him to come sit up on my lap. And he'll help me finish this video quick. Come here, James. <laughs> Mama and Jensen are upstairs for Jensen's virtual checkup appointment with his gastroenterologist. So, there's that. Yeah. Can you say bye? Bye. Good job. All right. Bye.